Sa panahon ngayon, mas madali pa magkaroon ng COVID kesa mahanap mo ang love life mo. Sakit, di ba? Pero totoo yun. Uh, COVID has taken so much of our life. We have lost so much. Um, so much. We have lost loved ones. We have lost opportunities. We have lost hope. Seriously, this past two years, we have, you know, nilagat sa pos ang buhay. Kasi matatapos naman yan, ayaw natin harapin ang problema. But what I've noticed ito, may mga kaibigan ako during this COVID season, nagkaroon ng tatlong trabaho. Yung mga babies na pinanganak ng COVID, hindi na baby ngayon, toddler na. <laughs> uh, may mga kaibigan ako naghiwalay, nagkaroon na ng bagong love life during this pandemic. And my question is, what about you? What have you been doing about your life? Have you found your purpose? Are you just working on life ng para kang robot, gigising sa umaga, kakain, magti-TikTok, magfi-Facebook, magi-Instagram, hahanapin mo yung crush mo, hahanapin mo yung ex mo, then gagawin mo yung kailangan mong gawin sa work, and then kain ulit, tulog, and you know, all these things na paulit-ulit. Maybe the past few years, you have lost your purpose. Or maybe... Hindi mo nga alam dati na may purpose ka sa buhay. Friends, baka sinasayang mo ang buhay mo. Your life is beautiful. Do you know when God made you, He made you to be a masterpiece. When God made you, He put so much attention in you. And everything, all your talents, your gifts, your wonderfulness, God put in you. But the problem is, when you were growing up, may mga pangaasar, may mga nangyari, uh, na nawalang ka ng bilib sa sarili mo, you had the wrong people in your life, or maybe even your closest loved ones stop believing in you or put you down. And all these things have added to destroy your hope in your life. Friends, I just want to tell you today that Maybe you have been believing in lie, a lie that you're not good enough, that you're a fake, that you are not worth anything. Maybe because wala nga nang mamahal sa iyo, wala nang pumapansin sa iyo. Landi ka nang landi, wala nang lumalandi back. I don't know. But seriously, maybe you've been living your life a little wrong. You've been you have been going the wrong way. What if the answer is pursuing God first? To let God love you first. Why? Brother J. Paul, why is it important to, for God to love me first? Or to let God love me first? Because God made you. God knows you. And He knows the perfect design and plan for your life. You see, in your heart, there is purpose. There is value. There is someone amazing. And when you get to when you allow God to love you, you are opening yourself to discover or rediscover that purpose that God has put inside you. My prayer for you this 2022 is to let God love you. And then as you let God love you, your heart will be open in knowing yourself more and know your true purpose. Stop wasting your life in a job that is not happy and not purposeful. Stop wasting your time in the wrong relationship. Stop wasting your life in looking for the wrong kind of love. I pray and I really encourage you on this. Look for your purpose first. Pursue it. And then, abundance will come. Blessings will come. Miracles will come. And when you find your purpose and you pursue it, the best is yet to come. Thank you for watching today's message. Um, new videos are uploaded every Monday. And I hope you can share it, tag, like, and comment because we want to really bless people this year. We want to bless and give hope to people to remind them that they can overcome any problem. This is J. Paul Hernandez and see you again on our next episode. Do not give up. Find your purpose. God loves you.